In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the array constraint function in Google Sheets. So the array constraint function is useful if you are regularly working with arrays. What it does is it constrains an array or a range of data to a specific size. So if you want to only work with a portion of data, you can use array constraint to return an array of a specific size that you input into the arguments of the function. So this is the basic syntax here. The first argument is the input range, and this is the range or the array. Um, it's basically the original data set that you want to return a specific number of rows and columns from. The next argument is the number of rows that you want to return from that input range. And the last argument is the number of columns that you want to return from that input range. So it's a pretty easy function to use. I will show you how to use it on this table. And what I will do with it is I will return five rows and five columns from this table. So equals array constraint. And so I put in my range here, and I want to return five rows, five columns, and that is what array constraint does. So this is most often used in combination with other functions that return arrays so that you can use it when you want to work with a specific portion of the data. So that is it for this video. It's a pretty easy function to use. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.